Hello everyone, here is Ola and my blog about Ukraine. A lot of you after my video about marriage agencies become thinking are you scammed by Ukrainian girls or not? And um, some of you asked me some advice, uh, uh, told his story and um, want to hear my opinion. And I bet a lot of you don't want to share your history with someone else and just sit with his own and thinking is he scammed or not. So I decided in this video just tell my imagination of this, tell my opinion about it and just you can, maybe this helps to make right decision uh, are you scammed or not by Ukrainian girls. And um, before I start, I want to say uh, this video is only about marriage agencies. So I don't tell that it's impossible to find um, girl in, in Ukraine to find girl for foreigners. It's not impossible that a Ukrainian girl got married with foreigners and live happily ever after. I just want to tell my uh, imagination about marriage agencies and how girls use them to find love and is it possible in general. And also before I start again, uh, I just want to suggest you don't think that grass is greener somewhere else. And don't think that there is a lot of beautiful Ukrainian women who sit alone at home and waiting just for love from some other continents. And don't be naive, of course, and analyze everything what you see and what you hear around you. Uh, okay, so I just want to... Uh, I just ask you some questions and at the same time I uh, tell my opinion. If you don't understand some of my words because I speak uh, sometimes very confusing, you can read my blog post, I, read, uh, I write everything the same and you can read it uh, and understand everything if you don't understand. Okay, so the first step. Uh, why you think girls decided to find men through marriage agencies? Uh, first of all, you need to realize that girl who you speak with, she already decided to find husband because she comes to marriage agencies. So she not just want to get acquainted uh, she, and maybe in prospectives have some relationship. Uh, she just exactly want to get married with some foreigner man. And um, there is a lot of place where you can find foreigners in Ukraine. There is nightclubs, there is some activity where there is a lot of foreigners and you can meet them. But they decided to go to marriage agencies understanding that they, there will be a relationship on a very big distance maybe. So why she did that? Uh, she can find true love in Ukraine because all Ukrainian men are poop. Uh, she lives in so poor country and live to want uh, want to live better and want to have a better life. Or all Ukrainian men don't know how to service uh, how to service women. If you choose one of these variant, you don't know everything about Ukraine and life there. Uh, I just want. Oh, maybe you have some other variant of answer. I just want to comment all of this and tell my opinion. So first, true love. These girls want to find true love and can't find it in Ukraine. We all know, uh, we all know that relationship on a distance is very, very hard. It's hard even if you live in different cities. But we speak about different countries and very often about different continents and different sides of the world. So how girls relate, imagine your dating? Um, what about um, uh, and what about you? What you want to, why you want to find girls from other side of the world? Because a lot of men said, Ukraine uh, women in our country, in any country, they want just money, they are not interested, they don't want to uh, see your soul and something else. You think Ukrainian women want something else? Of course, there is some type of woman who wants something else. This woman wants going out with you on weekends. This woman wants to have lonely evening together with you and feel your warm hands, uh, feel your warm body and feel you, your presence near yourself, near herself. But you are on a distance, it's love on a distance. What she can want from you except money? I don't know. 
and really you can't give anything else for her because you are on a distance yes maybe once time you come but once time on a half of a year it's not enough for a woman to every day feel presence every day know that oh i want to make beautiful makeup for him i want to buy new dress for him it's emotion and a woman is emotional person and they need this emotion they need to have boyfriend near them just not boyfriend virtual through computer who you can see just on skype maybe once a month and um, think about that because it's very very weird and you need to ask all always these girls why they started to use marriage agencies why you don't want to find somewhere in ukraine maybe maybe in some different countries is it normal that we can speak with you on a distance how you can imagine all of our meetings and everything else i think it's important because if you try to excuse you can excuse everything uh, you can find any other answer on these questions but in any um, in a lot of cases you just um, fire your money and waste your time just for scammers so think about it and every non-logical things you just need to be very intended to them and uh, the next one so like girls live in a poor country ukraine according to some official data maybe ukraine is kind of poor country but in fact we have just a lot of poor people and a lot of rich people so we don't have a lot of people somewhere in the middle but it's not problem for ukrainian girls if they are poor and want to live better find some rich husband especially if this girl is beauty because i think you always speak just with beautiful girl not just with ugly <laughs> so there is not there is no problem for them find rich man who can give them everything what they want but they decided to look better life somewhere abroad why and you need to receive clear answer on that and uh, the next one ukrainian men don't know how to service women of course it's that makes sense we have a lot of different women we have a lot of different men who can clean house cooking dishes for you and do everything so you can choose every man what you want for you okay but uh, we speak about purpose why this girl decided to use marriage agencies because there is a lot of different other way where you can meet boys but she decided to use marriage marriage agencies and if her purpose is clear for you you already know that no she don't lie me she have very very important reason why she decided to have relationship on distance and everything else okay so we move to next step does she know language uh, your language or any other language what is common with you so if she know language she already know language and she can use marriage agencies for good acquainted with some new man but i think her first letter must be okay here is my mail here is my skype here is my whatsapp viber facebook or something else and let's speak in private because i think it's logically that um, if you speak via mail via marriage mail someone um, else can read your letter someone else can uh, maybe in future use it for some bad purpose and of course it's better for you to speak in private that nobody else read your letters i think uh, it's logically but if you don't understand it uh, you can tell her you know honey i pay i pay for every message to you and let's use the same email but like gmail or something else and we can speak with you normal if she said no spend money and speak with you and speak with me so you already scammed because she wanted you spend money if you don't spend money she don't need you because for uh, if she just want to find love there is not important for her which way to use and of course don't believe that i can't uh, i don't know how to use computer i don't know how to use mail it's i don't know i think even 50 years old woman in ukraine know how to use all of this stuff and i have problems for with the internet i have some other i think now internet is almost in every village and um, if she don't have normal internet why well, that's that's her problem i don't know it's it's very suspicious really it's very suspicious because we have enter internet everywhere and you can find internet everywhere even in village even in deep village so that's not true and you can be already scammed 
And other things about Skype. Mm, oftenly you said me that girls refuse Skyping with you because they said, I'm not ready yet, uh, I can't install Skype on my computer or some else. Is it not ridiculous? You're already ready if you uh, decided to go to marriage agencies for finding husband. So you don't met her on the street, you don't met her on the nightclubs and she's not ready yet or something else. You don't find her somewhere else. You find her through marriage agencies and she already wants to find husband and don't want to speak with him face to face. <laughs> it's stupid. Maybe you're ugly, maybe you have ugly voice, maybe she's ugly and have ugly voice or something else. I very often see some beautiful girl and she think, wow, she maybe is very beautiful, but just he started speaking, you understand, wow, that's not my type of person or about girl, about man. So you need to know her, you need to speak with her, not only she's ready or not, you must be ready to speak with her uh, in future. So you need Skyping and I think it's normal and she must to install Skype on your computer or uh, go to service that they install if she can't. But you need to speak with her face to face at least, at least once a time in the beginning that you know that you don't waste your time with this woman. Maybe she has ugly voice. <laughs> And uh, of course, if she always refuses, there is always some problem, you are scammed. And as, um, as soon as you understand this, as more as less money you waste, you need to understand this. And of course, the most interesting questions, if girls don't know language, if she don't know language, how she decided to find foreign husband, how she realized in, in, in some relationship with him, if she don't know his language through translator, so you will live through trans you will live with translator, and you will date in this translator. How can it be? How you can fall in love with person if you don't understand his words? If you these words can touch your heart, you can fall in love only with translator, but not this person who you dating exactly. So she needs to know language, and if she decided to find foreign husband don't know in language, she can find uh, some foreigners who already know Ukrainian or Russian language. We have a lot of them in Ukraine because they study at university or working in international companies. Or she can find some man from former USSR who already moved to uh, USA, Mexico and any other countries because we have a lot of them too. And uh, again, she doesn't need to know language, but find man, foreigners and don't know even English, but he promised if you give me money, or even don't give me money at least, but I will, I will learn it in future. So you need to already know language, how we can speak with you. How many Mexicans you know, how many Russians you know who live uh, in states for a long time, who work in, in states and still don't know language and don't understand anything. So maybe this person, there is a lot of type of person who can't learn foreign language or something else and if she is uh, not so old, this girl, she studied English at school. So if she already don't know language, so maybe there is really problem with studying inter um, international language. So I think, I think you need to worry about it and you need to think about it. She must know language, she must learn language or you can find other girl who know language or ask her purpose how you imagine our relationship. I will. I don't know Russian, Ukrainian, you don't know English or Spanish or something else. How you just imagine we can live with you. I'm not ready for waiting for 100, <laughs> for 10 years when you will learn my language and we can speak with you. So that is what, that was my logic. Sorry for long video, I just want to tell everything how it was and maybe you think mm, there is a lot of weird things when I speak with her, there is always some weird things but um, I think don't be naive, don't try to find some excuse because very often, no, not very often but <laughs> sometimes I see some story on TV on news when some foreigners come to Ukraine for girls, of course, nobody met him, he get nervous, he started crying, he go to police, he decided, he um, realized that he was full, he was scammed and um, he just 
try to deport me to other con to my countries and I never want to hear about Ukraine. There's a very popular story and it's I think it's the worst that can happen and the best what can happen is just that you waste money. So don't try to find an excuse for some non-logical things. Don't speak with these girls. Just um, require very clear answer, clear purpose. And if you believe her, so maybe you're not scammed and you will have happy life with your future wife. And that's what I wish you would not be scammed and find your love in Ukraine or in any other countries. Just what you want. Thank you for watching this video. Of course, I'm waiting for your comments. Maybe you disagree with me, maybe you agree. That's my logic and that's what I want to say to you. Maybe this will help. Thank you for watching. Love you all. Bye.